puede ser que, que tenemos mala suerte o puede ser que tenemos lesiones, son excusas. Porque el equipo ha demostrado hoy, ha demostrado el, el partido contra Madrid de, ser, de estar a un buen nivel, pero estar a un buen nivel no es suficiente. Que lo que cuenta al final siempre es el resultado. Y son dos partidos perdidos y cada uno tiene que analizar su partido. Intento yo analizar el partido de hoy. Es increíble que... So Kuman was Barcelona boss for 67 games and won 39 of them, but lost nearly a quarter of his matches in charge, leaving him with a win rate of 58%. His sacking was confirmed, while Real Madrid boss Carlo Ancelotti was speaking to the media following their goalless draw with Osasuna. A mí me han destituido muchas veces. Estoy sigo, sigo aquí vivo, contento. Es parte de tu trabajo ser destituido. Y yo la única cosa que digo es que tiene que darlo todo hasta que tú eres entrenador. El día después que te echan o que te destituyen, mirar adelante con la conciencia tranquila que ha dado todo. Yo creo que Coman está dando todo lo que puede dar. So this is the situation facing Koeman's replacement. Barca are ninth, six points behind leaders Real Madrid. They've scored just 15 goals in 10 games, their lowest tally at this stage of a season for 17 years. The feeling, as, as I said, is that the um, uh, team maybe was not as good enough uh, to be first or second in the league, but he could be better, third, fourth, and not in the ninth place, of course, now out of Europe. And with the sensation and with the feeling inside the club, that uh, things could be even better if Ronald Koeman keeps on being a Football Club Barcelona coach. And maybe this year, which is something that has never happened, could, they could be out of the UEFA Champions League for the next year, apart from the situation they've got this season with only uh, one good game after losing against Bayern Munich and Benfica. So tensions now turn to who could replace Kuban at the new Camp. Former midfielder Xavi is one of the favourites. He's currently managing Al Saad in Qatar.